before starting the video i just want to tell you that now i'm doing game rental slash offline activation service basically any game you can imagine uh, i have that like call of duty modern warfare 1 2 3 star wars jedi survivor avatar Phantoms of pandora and many more so if you are interested in that you can comment down below or join my discord and come to the particular group hey everyone welcome back on the channel welcome back to the uh, long awaited episode 3 video of assassin's creed mirage so first before starting the mod let me tell that assassin's creed mirage is currently free to play for the uh, first two hours i think like uh, at the end of this month till the end of this month uh, which is april uh, 2024 so if you have not uh, played the game like if you want to try the game before buying uh, you can just take a trial of the game for the first two hours and then you can decide if you want to buy this game or not so i have not activated the mod right now and i am playing on 1080p with uh, borderless so borderless is also needed for this mod to work so do set it on borderless before installing the mod and graphics preset is everything is on high with uh, native ta like this is 1080p native uh, setting without uh, any kind of mod installed and the place i'm getting around is uh, 60 to 70 depending on scenarios and textures uh, so yeah we'll begin installing the mod uh, but uh, first let me tell you that uh, this mod will be for the gtx okay that's a very glitchy situation gtx and the rtx series but uh, i think amd users can also use the mod i'm not 100 percent sure since i don't have uh, any of my teammate to help me with uh, amd card uh, they all have gtx and rtx card so yeah uh, i can't really tell if it works but you do try and let me know in the comment section uh, and yeah we'll begin the mod installing now first we're gonna quit the game now you will be needing this uh, zip from the link in the description or you can find it on my discord channel so we're gonna extract it to the desktop now after extracting we're gonna open the folder and inside the folder you will see few files and folders so we're just gonna run the uh, this uh, look at the uh, mod installer as administrator so select first select it right click on it then click on run it as administrator run as administrator so now uh, with this mod open by default it will be like this so what you need to do is follow me step by step so first click on this fsr 3.0 fg mod and after that uh, so at the game select tab uh, select your game from this drop down list below currently these games are supported by this uh, wizard mod so you can use this mod uh, to, to use the fsr 3 also in some other games like this uh, so I, i've got most of this uh, like uh, mods uh, completed or uh, uploaded on the channel so yeah we'll try the essence speed mirage so select this one from the list and after that uh, what you need to do is uh, browse the game directory where the main files are located like for suppose uh, for me it's uh, here like uh, under the new folder tab the whole game is located under the new folder tab uh, so i will need to select the new folder tab so yeah click on the browse option then the exact location of the folder like uh, here is the new folder so i just need to select the new folder not anything inside of it like you can literally see that game is located under the new folder so i'm just going to select the new folder here and then i'm going to click on ok and don't need to do anything just make sure that enable pack nvidia gpu is true don't touch anything or else it won't work uh, so just click on the install option uh, but if you are an expert user you can just uh, do some tweak over here like how much uh, fps resolution the resolution you can set but uh, i do not recommend doing that just first try the mod if it works or not if it works then you can always come back to this uh, position and do your tweaks again so yeah just click on the install option and it will take some time and it will say that mod installation complete missing files no missing files if you don't see uh, this uh, same as this then you need to do something and verify your game files again so yeah click on ok now close this uh, wizard and we're just gonna run the game you can run the game from the installation folder or the uh, ubi soft launcher whichever you want uh, so i'm just gonna run it from the installation folder 
and you will see to this uh, CMD window will pop up. Okay, one thing I forgot to mention, which is uh, you will be need to use the DLSS to use this mod. So uh, after opening the game, uh, I think uh, every GPU should be able to use the DLSS by now with this mod applied. So you just need to restart again because this game works like that. So you need to go to the graphics option. Then if you have the adaptive quality on, then turn it off. And after that, uh, go to the upsample type and select the DLSS. You'll be able to see the DLSS even on non-RTX GPUs. Uh, so select the DLSS and select the upsample quality to whichever you like and then you can click on apply and you need to restart the game once in order to make the DLSS apply. So yeah, I'm coming back with the game restarted. Okay, so I have restarted the game and uh, came back. So I'll just show you that DLSS is currently applied uh, like here. Uh, you can add or disable the sharpness. It's totally up to you. This mod is totally compatible with sharpness. So yeah, I'm gonna add a little bit of sharpness and uh, motion blur turn that thing off and yeah now we'll just start the game and see how much more fps we're getting now we are back uh to the game and as you can see that uh, fps has now boosted from 60 to 120 110 uh, yeah it's hovering around 110 and 20 sometimes it's going above and sometime below so yeah, I'm recording on 4K, but without recording, I was getting around almost 100 to 130, 135 FPS, if I recall. Uh, but yeah, this will do. Uh, so if I stop recording, it will get even better, like 130 and all. Uh, also, now I'll show you how to fix the food in issue. So all you need to do is after installing the mod, uh, like you have selected DLSS from the main menu, we start the game come back to the game and uh, you, as you see that uh, frame rate has boosted now all you need to do is go to the option graphics and now from the upsample from dlss you need to switch to ta and in inside ta you will also able to select quality balance whichever you like so yeah just hit uh, apply and come back to the game your fps will be a little bit lower uh, than usual i think uh, yeah it's a little bit lower like uh, it was around uh, 110 and 20 but now it's around 100 to 110 it's a little bit lower but the code glitching is totally fixed as you can see here there is no code glitching and no subtitle or character or ghost flickering on Merchant everything has left his there as you can see no subtitle flickering an and easy everything. One to begin with. Uh, but the fps is a little bit lower so yeah you will have to choose uh, which one you want like uh, uh, super uh, high fps or like uh, a little bit lower fps but no ghost flicker so yeah this will be it guys uh hope this video helps you uh you can subscribe to the channel if it helps it helps really uh, a lot and you can comment down below if you face any kind of issue also the game is be free to play uh for like uh, 30 of april like it's still 10 days remaining by the time of making this video so if you haven't checked this out you can check the game like you can play two hours straight uh without any issue and uh, yeah, uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. Till then, uh, cheers. Happy